uh, say, uh, mister, I had this watch, this uh, gold pocket watch it was, and um, it, no, it belonged to my brother, and it ain't worth Drew. nothing except to me, but uh, the, 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 the thing of it is that I promised my ma that Drew, I, I wouldn't... Drew, these men seen your watch. Well, now we'll be moving on. So long. Tick tock. Tick tock. Tick tock. Sir, I'd advise you to hand that over on account of my friend here is a lightning gunman. Lightning gunman, is he? Hobbs, you must be crapping all over yourself. Well, I guess we ain't got no choice but to try to defend ourselves. Look, now, we don't want no trouble. We're just gonna get on this mule and light out of here, all right? You little sack of shit. <laughs>
November 27th, 1863. I have tried to look on the bright side of all of this, but I can't think of what it would be. I have been robbed of all my money and left to die on the prairie alone and friendless. Weather good. November 28th, 1863. I have determined not to die after all. If the children of Israel could endure 40 years in the desert, then a Greenville, Ohio boy ought to not give up. I shot and ate a skunk today. The taste didn't enter much into it. November 29th, 1863. If I ever find Jake Rumsey, I will kill him. you been with Joe Simmons' gang? About a month, sir. What jobs you pull? A couple of stagecoaches over by Aletha. A few stray travelers a little east of here. A cafe down in Mansfield, and then this. Is that all? Yes, sir. How many Joe got in his gang now? Uh, ten, no nine. Not counting me. Where'd you head out? Son, in a couple of minutes, you're going to be face to face with your maker. After what you did here to these people, I think it'll go down a lot easier with the Lord. You'll help us out now as much as you can. Follow that trail out front, west about 20 miles till you come to a cutoff heading north. Take that till you come to an old rundown shack. That's them. Hoist him up, boys. Sure. 